Hey guys, it's me, Teacher Jane, and welcome to my channel! For today's topic, we will be dealing with measurements. Sorry, yes, DJ. For today's objectives, we are going to identify the basic units in the metric system. Convert measurements from one unit to another in the metric system. The metric system is an internationally agreed decimal system of measurement created in France in 1799. The metric system uses the Greek and Latin prefixes to make conversion from smaller unit to a larger unit and vice versa easier. A prefix is a power of 10 exponent. Kilo, hecto, deca are prefixes from the Greek word, while deci, centi, and mili are Latin word prefixes. Ito ang tinatawag nating metric converter. Mamagitan nito, malalaman natin kung ang decimal natin ay papunta sa kanan o sa kaliwa kapag tayo ay nagko-convert ng unit. Now, let's proceed with measures of length. The basic unit we used in measuring length is meter. So, we use kilometer, hectometer, decameter, decimeter, centimeter, and millimeter as our metric converter using measures of length. Example, convert 4 kilometer to meter. Para makonvert natin ang 4 kilometers into meters, gagamitin natin yung ating metric converter. Iko-convert natin ay ang 4 kilometers. So, pwede natin itong isulat as 4.0 kilometer para makita natin yung decimal. So, kung mapapansin natin from km to meter ang ating conversion. So, ang m ay nasa kanan ng meter, ng kilometer. So, bibilangin natin mula sa kilometer. So, dadaan tayo sa hectometer, decameter, to meter. 1, 2, 3. So, from kilometer to meter, ay meron tayong 3 space. So, yung movement ng ating decimal from 4.0, 1, 2, 3. So, that becomes 4,000.0 M. So, therefore, 4 kilometers is equal to 4,000 meters. 
Let's have another example. Convert 2.8 cm centimeters to meters. So, using our metric converter, co-convert natin yung 2.8 centimeter to meter. So, hanapin natin yung cm. Then, m. So, kung mapapansin nyo, ilang space ang meron. So, meron tayong 1, 2. Napapunta sa left. So, ibig sabihin, ang movement ng ating decimal ay papunta rin sa left. So, 2 spaces to the left. So, we will start with 2.8. So, count to the left, 1, 2. So, ibig sabihin, ang 2.8 centimeter is equal to 0 0.028 meters. O, di ba? Ganun lang kadali mag-convert ng unit. So, no need to use calculators or multiply it by 10. Another one is we have convert 1.2 meters to centimeter. Again, let's use our metric converter. Hanapin natin yung unit. So, ang unit na given ay meter pupunta sa centimeter. So, nasaan ang centimeter? Nasa kanan ba o nasa kaliwa? Correct! Nasa kanan. So, bilangin ang unit. So, meron tayong 2 spaces. So, 1.2 becomes 120 centimeters. Now, let's proceed with measure of mass or weight. So, ganun ulit, gagamitin pa rin natin ang ating metric converter. But this time, ang ating uh, unit of measure kapag mass or weight ang hinahanap, we use grams. So, kilogram, hectogram, decogram, decigram, centigram, and milligram. So, yan naman ang gagamitin nating metric converter kapag hinahanap naman natin or nakoconvert tayo ng unit measure of weight. Okay. Convert 50 kilogram to grams. So, ganun ulit katulad ng ginawa natin kanina. From kilo to grams. So, magbibilang tayo ilang space or ilang unit. So, 1, 2, 3. So, from kilogram to gram, so 50.0 kilogram, we have, so, imumove lang natin yung decimals. So, magiging 50,000.0 grams. So, 50 kilogram is equal to 50,000 grams. Sorry, it's DJ. Hey.
gonna rush now, never gonna rush now My life's in a slow-mo, always in a slow-mo I still show up on time Stay a minute, another minute Hold on a second, I love this moment, yeah Stay a minute, another minute Hold on a second, I love this moment, yeah Stay a minute, another minute Hold on a second, I love this moment Chagi nege na tana juno. Nan amu mal do hal suga opsoji. Chon nune banan danen iyagi ga. Nol ponen sungan ihe ga desa. Me bon ya 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 ya. Ulo nol ya 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 ya. Ne manul go be kario go. Timing man bonen na. Kuron na dolon bomyo. I'm good. 